Do you feel like when someone dies from drinking, it's not passing away, it's just dying? Yeah. Like, I don't it's think different. that's like, passed away is like, he was, you know, he was like getting old and he passed away. Like, like dude fucking drank like 32 <laughs> beers and he fucking vomited and choked on Like, he, he died. died. He just died. The best thing about Andrew is that he shares a love of hatred for Maroon 5 with me. Yeah, fuck that shit. <laughs> Do you like Maroon 5? No. I don't, I don't hate it though, I don't really I care. Hate it. Can I say For that sure. anytime I'm out anywhere, the, anytime I hear like a song sung by a guy, I'm always like, who sings this? And everyone's like, Maroon 5, Adam Levine. Like every fucking the song on the radio songs. is that dude. It's oh, that's the, the dude worst. from the fucking- Him, him or Bruno Mars. Bruno Boys. Every, my mom watches that shit. She has a crush on that dude. <laughs> every mom like, oh, has a crush Adam on that Levine's dude. Adam Levine's so hot. And I'm like, like mom. mom, stop. Yeah, she told me when she's like, Oh, like I got a haircut when she's like, oh, I like your hair, it looks like Adam Levine. I'm like, ew, the dude you think is hot? For, what? I was like, that's weird, like on so <laughs> many levels, level? that's not cool. Like, first I was like, I don't look anything like that dude, you're out of your mind. I was like, wait, don't you think that dude's, uh. like, Yeah, tell your Adam Levine story, because you told me that and it was really good. Yeah, yeah so, um, so I'm into all kinds of music and I love Vanessa Carlton, like the, back in the day when that Thousand Miles song came out. And uh, so we went and saw her and my girlfriend at the time got me tickets and then she was in college yeah, no big, just banging older chicks. Mm. And uh, so <laughs> she was in college. She couldn't come up from Baltimore to go to the show in Philadelphia with me. So I took my friend Ronnie. We went, afterwards we went and got cheesesteaks at uh, this place just right across. And so whatever, we're sitting there and then we see the dude from the opening band. And I was like, oh, you were in that opening band, right? And he's like, yeah. And I was like, cool, man, good for you. You know, like, yeah, you guys were you good, you know? Rock on. And, uh, so then the dude's like talking to us for a little bit. He's like, oh, like, what do you guys do, you know? And uh, so the whole time we're chatting, he's like playing around with like a pen and like he's done his cheesesteak, but he's like playing around with a pen and like a pe like his plate. And I'm like, okay, whatever. And then we're like, all right, man, well, we'll see you later. You know, and he's like, oh, cool. And he hands me this plate and it's a caricature of myself on a skateboard. And it was like something like blah, blah, blah. Like, and then it said, I guess, Adam Maroon 5. And it was the dude from Maroon 5 yeah drew a caricature of me on a plate and gave it to me. And I was like, wow, that band fucking sucked and threw it in the trash as soon as I left. Oh my God. And I was like, damn it, man. Like, I wish I would have just kept it because it would have just been a cool memory. But it would have been great for our wall. Yeah, right. That would have been great for <laughs> eBay. That's what it would have been great for. Hot, any mom. can draw, <laughs> any can sing. Oh no. God, that's see, why no. all moms want to That's your him, opinion. Dude. I think it was him. I, it was one of the dudes in the band, but I think it was him because that's usually who I pay attention to the most. Is the like singer. a super hot singer. Yeah. So the babe front man, huh? Yeah, he's just always paying attention to the hot guys. I'm just that's <laughs> why I pay attention to you, Matt. <laughs> What's up? What Little Mermaid songs do you guys? Sing I think it was Under the Sea. I could sing all of them. Can you guys sing like do a duet? Oh, like you guys Mermaid sing as Sebastian and Ariel and I stuff. I can do the voices. Yeah. The nice. seaweed is always greener. <laughs> and somebody else's lake. That one? You dream about going up there. But that is a big mistake. <laughs> just look at the world around right, you. I can't keep yeah. going with it. That's Wait, no, he can keep going. Floor. But just, so, yeah, going just so you guys know, that's like that's a thing that happens sometimes. Under the sea. I heard. All right, yeah, I like that. And what's funny is it happened like when I first met Matt. Oh, like, so you started singing and then you no, kind he had it on in the car, <laughs> and I was like, oh. we when, the I, car. when I go out with new skaters that I haven't shot with, I like to like you know just he's like, into it. Break yeah. the, you know, I don't want like. I don't want to think I'm weird or anything. So, I'm trying so to... Lion King soundtrack, no, but ease well, no. into it with with Little Mermaid. I Price think what it is the finer things in life. Well, Andrew's like on my level of just like I think liking weird shit, but like some people you go out and shoot with, and it's like I'm like, oh god, like what am I gonna play like music wise? And you're like, yeah. you're like, yeah, let me just put on fucking like every Morrissey song I have, or just like Black <laughs> Sabbath. Like I don't even really like Black Rick Sabbath. Ross. I know I'm not allowed to say that because like it's skateboarding and it's yeah. like, oh, like don't say that. I back it, but like. Dude's like, it's like, I'll oh, just like, okay, Black Sabbath the whole time, you know, just keep it on low just so it's like there, but it's like, if something, like, Andrew's in the car, I'm like, fuck yeah, dude, we can listen to Little Mermaid, like, I just have to go so far the opposite to like... I just like that you guys are sensitive. So, I don't know if it's a sense, we're just psyched. I don't yeah. actually think we're that sensitive. I yeah. think that they're just fans I don't mean of great in a bad way. show tune sort of things, Little soundtracks. Just, Disney movies are good. Yeah. Like, yeah. that's just... That's kind of sensitive. <laughs> have you ever seen a donkey show? No. Ooh, have you? No, I want to. And no, in El Paso, no, no, no. Apparently in El Paso, no. there's a lion mm -hmm. show. Like a on the lion? other side. In, Did you say is lion? It is it Juarez on the other side of El Paso? Apparently there's a lion show. Down in we the were, Texas. It's a well-trained animal. I think they probably declawed him. It's very inappropriate with to the animal. Declawed it, but its mouth. Right. They'd have to. 
Well, it's more about the, the Hannibal see, I mean, the, I, I, I'm more worried about it eating my face rather than clawing. You don't want the foreplay. I don't think your you don't face want is what it's going to eat. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I don't want to see it for like the arousal purpose. I just want to see it because it's like one of those things to be like, yeah. Whoa. Why don't you just look it's it up? All that. You, you have to see this in person. Is this no, one of those things like, like you gotta Ham. see it to believe it? It seems a lot creepier to look at, like searching yeah, like, on the internet than like just be like, oh, I'm in some Then in place person? Like, yeah. yeah, because at least like, you're like, oh, in what, was some on your place, like, like, what was on your computer? Yeah. Like, uh, bestiality, like, that dude's fucked up. And then it's also not just like, was <laughs> oh, it yeah, one time? But witnessing it in person and paying to see it, not messed up at all. It's part of a culture. You know, exactly. You go, down, you go down south and you're like, I, I want to experience so. the culture. And you're like, <laughs> this is just part of it. This is what happens yeah. after 3 a.m. And I'll have a burrito. It, I'll like. see a donkey show. Yeah. Yeah. What is it about Ryan Reyes' butt that you guys like so much? It's nice. It's a good butt. <laughs> you know what it was? The first time I saw a picture of his butt, I think Price was like, dude, check out this ass. Come on. And dude. I saw <laughs> it and I was like, damn. Yeah. That's a good butt. And then he was like, it's Ryan Reyes's. And like, <laughs> that's like I'm the joke. Sure. Like, Indifferent now. It's that's like fun to fuck with someone because like, dude, people see his butt and it's like, dude, check out this girl's ass. And like, they look at it and they're like, damn, like everyone without a doubt is like, oh shit. Like, and then you just zoom out and it's like Ryan, like. So <laughs> Have you ever had like, him? Oh, like, God, I would eat is it that. Is all like, man, let me get a piece. Matt, can you tell us about Andrew's bachelor party? He probably can't tell you anything about it. <laughs> Andrew can tell you about Andrew's bachelor party. Tell us about your bachelor party, Andrew. So I got married uh, like two and a half years ago. And so we're driving there to the strip club in Philadelphia. And if uh -huh. anyone has ever been there, show and tell. It is so grimy, but it's awesome. I remember in the strip club, two of the most amazing things, or one was amazing, <laughs> the other one was vile. But one of them was, they were doing this thing. I, I, thought, it, I thought it should be called butt skip ball. It was sick. They'd take a cup, <laughs> like a, a cup like this. And the girls would spread their butt cheeks and put the cup in between their butt cheeks and like let it clap shut like that. Uh -huh. And they'd bend over and they'd like pivot around in a circle and dudes would crinkle up dollars into balls and try and throw it into the cup. But oh, the wow. target was their, their cornhole. Yeah, their butthole was here and then the cup. So like you backboard off the butthole and then into the cup. So like, wow. this is better than the ball koozie. You don't even mean anything, opinion. which it's is different. weird. It's sort of different. Butt skip ball is better. It's is good. that what you said, butt, butt skip ball? What was the vile thing? Because if it's what I'm thinking, I'm going to be like, come on. It was, no, sick. it was sick, but it was like when you think about it in the circumstances, yeah. like at one point, like it was kind of blackout for me, like where you just have like holes and all of a sudden you remember this is something no matter how blacked out you are, you don't forget. Yeah. Mm. You're in a strip club and like all of a sudden, like someone, all these dudes start yelling and I'm like, what the fuck? Why are, like, what's going on? Is something weird happening? Yeah. Dude, this girl is just fucking violently dildoing the other girl. Like just like live sex show, just like going down, oh. just like, and it was it like, oh better. wow, we all walked up like, holy shit, like this is fucking going down. Like, Oh, and it wow. felt like this was like fake, you know, and we're like, oh, like, fuck yeah, do it, I guess, you know, and then all of a sudden, like, dude, just girl just erupts and just squirts all over, like, a, pretty much one dude <laughs> who's right in front of her and just... Oh, he was in the splash zone. The yeah. dildo shoots out. Dude, it just shot a rocket. It was insane. Like, just, it was like, you don't see things like that in real life. Like, it was like, I've never even seen porn on the internet like that. It's like SeaWorld. Like They're like, and next up, we have Shamu on the main stage. <laughs> I've heard about the ball koozie, but mm. I've had a ball koozie. <laughs> More just like a, just to say we did it, you know, better do it, like, why not? You've had one? Yeah. Really? Dude, there's a lot of weird shit that- From no. who? <laughs> Come on, let me, dude! Let me no. give you her name yeah. and address. Oh, no, yeah. Google work, her. Work, work and sell. Sorry, I thought yeah. it slipped by, I From thought who? Slipped by you. As if you know those, her, too. I thought your guard was down. It's one of those things where no, when you're like... I was wondering if it was a dude or not. You're really... <laughs> wish. You know, when you're really comfortable with someone, you're just like, hey, we should do this. This is funny. Like, you know, and it's like... No, I guess I was maybe going, like, just was going to hear if you said, like, oh, it was an ex-girlfriend or a random whatever, but... No. That's right. No, I don't expect that information. thought you wanted a first and last name. Yeah, no, I'm no, not going to give you her Facebook know. URL. Yeah. <laughs> you imagine I know you, you want meet that, a random Rob. girl, you're like, I know you she roll. goes to kiss you, you're like, oh, I can't, like, but I'm down for a ball koozie. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I just Kissing ball koozie. I don't kiss on the first date, but a ball koozie. <laughs> I'm a virgin, but I'll give you a ball koozie. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Dude, it was the scariest thing ever. I've never seen, like, a person go from, like, Heath's, like, docile eyes, just, like, yeah. chilling to, like, at all with y'all so y'all gonna have to peep this by yourself look away if you're under 13 look away <laughs>